What's up guys, Drifty here from Driftwood Gaming and this is a special request RPG Maker MV tutorial for Isaac Olguin. And he says, hey Driftwood, big fan of yours, could it be possible to make a weapon that changes elements randomly like an elemental gun that fires fire on one turn and then thunder on the next turn? Well, Isaac, I've got something special made for you. This is going to be the elemental pistol. So the elemental pistol um, is using Yanfly's Weapon Unleashed plugin. So you will need a few plugins for this. You'll need the Yanfly Core Engine, the Equip Core. You'll need the um, probably the Battle Engine Core, uh, and also Yanfly's Weapon Unleashed plugin. So um, this pistol has a 40% chance to do regular damage, a regular attack, but it has a 10% chance to use. Um, each of the elements, so a total of 60% chance that you're going to get an elemental attack. So let's uh, not do that, let's do this. Uh, okay, attack, it's a regular one. We're doing attack again, it's regular. So there's our arrow shot. We'll just speed it up. There's our shock shot. Flame shot. There's an aqua shot. A geo shot. We might get them all. I think that was all of them. Arrow shot there. Frost shot. Shock shot to finish it off. Nice. Cool. So let me show you how to make that. It's not too hard to actually do the, the technical part of it, um, but getting all the skills made and everything is going to be the, the biggest hurdle. So what you're going to be doing, let's look at the plugins first. Um, install Yanfly's core engine, install the, the battle engine core, install the equip core, and the weapon unleash plugin, and in that order. Uh, once you've got them installed, they're already optimized, so you won't have to change anything in the parameters of the plugins. But you'll need to make six skills, or any number of skills you want for your weapon to have. I've chosen six. Uh, and I've made the Flame Shot, Frost Shot, Shock Shot, Aqua Shot, Geo Shot, and Arrow Shot. But what you can do is design one of them, and then just copy-paste, change a few things, copy-paste, change a few things. So I'm going to go over one of them, and then you can just uh, change them as you see fit. So give it a name, an icon. You can create custom icons if you want to. It's real easy to do custom icons, just load it up into uh, GIMP or Photoshop and then just copy paste one into uh, the gun into a, a blank spot and I've got tutorials on this that you can see how I do this but I've made custom icons here. So um, give it an icon, a description. If you want to use these text note tags in the description that'll make it even uh, look a little bit better when you look at the description. I also award these skills to um, the class, the Mystic Gunslinger, so they'll be able to, to use these skills um, for TP or MP, but they'll also randomly occur when you use the Elemental Pistol. So uh, let's go back to the skills. Um, you can choose whatever skill type you want, MP, TP, cost up to you, scope one enemy, occasion battle screen. <coughs> Excuse me. These are a physical attack. Um, you can give it custom animations. That's probably what took me the longest. Uh, the way that I've gone about doing the custom animations is I've copied the um, gun, the shot, where is it at? The shoot normal one, I've just copied that and pasted it here and then um, chosen to give it a, a secondary graphic. Like in this case uh, for the fire shot I've gone with the fire 2, changed the hue a little bit and then uh, on the third frame I start going like this and then I add this one go to new and you can quickly press 0 0 and then hit OK and on the next frame you can go this one right click new 0 0 and then go like maybe 150 percent scale and then just go through all of them and repeat that by making the, the animations cycle through the different uh, the different patterns and increase the opacity or decrease the capacity increase the image size and you'll have a, a custom animation before you know it then you can just add some more sound effects like I think I did on uh, frame three. I just added like 
a fire attack and then uh, maybe on frame 9 I did another one but that's uh, how you would go about making the custom animations for this gun once you've got um, all your skills uh, well we have to go over this damage first we're gonna make it HP damage and uh, for the flame shot you're gonna select fire and then of course and you're gonna just do that um, respectively so for the frost shot would be ice and the shock shot would be thunder aqua shot and water so forth and so on uh, the damage formula is a unique one it's going to be a.atk times 2 plus a.mat times 2 plus a.agi times 2 plus a.luk times 2 so it's using four different stats in this but you can change this if you want to I've kept the variance 20 percent and I've allowed criticals and I've also created a, a custom state for each uh, shot so if we go to our states I've made a burning state uh, a chilled state soak state shock state rock state and dizzy state and they're all just element uh, based like burning bleeding effects so you can just make a burning effect you might already have one actually I've uh, set it to three turns only and uh, remove it into battle and remove if they 10% chance if they take damage it'll be removed uh, and doing negative HP regeneration 5% on each one of them um, so it's just a minor small like weak poison for each one of these but they'll stack up so that's the idea behind using multiple to stack these up. Um, once we've got our states on our skills you're gonna just uh, go to the effects and uh, add a state for example the the flame shot would add burning so you would just add your burning state and set it to whatever percentage chance you would like it to be and that's it you just copy this paste that change the icon to frost and then go down change the element to ice change this description to ice and state that will inflict to whatever number state that it is so for my IT 30 here is calling for state 30 which would be burning <clears throat> so um, pretty much simple you just repeat the process for all the shots gone over the states now let's go over to the weapon the weapon itself is a gun and it's gonna use a regular animation of the, the shoot normal default animation but um, it's also using the note tags for weapon only so this uh, plugin is really awesome and uh, at first I wasn't sure if I was going to use it but once I saw Yanfly's video on it I'm like I'm totally going to use this plugin and it's super easy to do um, all you have to do is type in weapon unleash and then the percent chance that you want the regular attack to do something different uh, and then you would just do a colon and then you would type in the name of the skill you wanted to replicate and then close the brackets and you can even have it do as I showed you multiple skills so it's going to check to do a uh, flame shot first and if it doesn't get that 1 out of 10 chance it's going to try to do a uh, frost shot if it doesn't get that 1 out of 10 it's going to go down to the next to the next to the next to the next and if none of these trigger then it's just going to do a regular attack 40% of the time um, I've gone to give uh, I've decided to give the gun uh, attack magic attack agility and luck since it's actually uh, the, all of these weapon unleashed shots are based off of these four stats so I've decided to give it a little bit of each but you can change those numbers depending on how you do your game um, but that's basically it so um, give it some custom icons some custom animations and, and throw in some note tags after you put those plugins in uh, your plugin manager and you've got a uh, elemental pistol and a, myth a mythical or mystic gunslinger if you want to look at this class I'll do a class spotlight on it uh, probably in a few more days I've got some stuff to do I'm still on vacation but this was a special request so I thought I'd uh, do something special for you but anyway if you like if you guys like this video remember to like favorite share and subscribe thank you guys so much for your support thank you for being awesome um, if you have a special request put it in the comments below and I'll get to it so thanks uh, for watching this video you guys are great and we'll see you in the next tutorial